Let me start this video by saying that I'm not an influencer, I just hire them. And lately I've been running into a lot of issues with influencers reaching out to me who want to do work for my clients, but then the follow through on their end kind of sucks. So here's a few tips to make sure that your next influencer deal goes well. And if you're a new influencer, hit me up. I might have a paid deal for you. Number one, I would much rather you over communicate with me than under communicate with me. So if we're going to do a deal and you're going to plan on posting something, when you post, be sure to DM us and let me know. But even better, email us and let us know so that we can track the results. If you DM a business who has a large following, odds are you're going to get buried underneath dozens of other messages that company has already received. So jump right into your email and, and let us know. We want to be a part of it. Number two is should be a pretty simple one, but it appears to not be. And that's just simply do what you say you're going to do. Don't over promise. Don't lie about your numbers. Just do what you say you're going to do. And that's pretty simple. And once you've done it, follow up to see what we think. And even if the promotion didn't go as well as we wanted it to, if you're honest about it, it's much more likely that I'll hire you again. Number three is there's no reason why you should be embarrassed if you think that my idea isn't as good as your idea because you know your community. I only think I know your community. So if my idea doesn't jive with what you know works with your community, then tell me, right? Don't do a shitty promotion because you didn't want to stand up and say, hey, David, I've tried that before. It doesn't work or that time of day doesn't work for me. If you know you have a time of day that works for you, then tell us. We want to know. Speaking of things we want to know, we want to know about your numbers and your honest numbers. So that actually translates into don't buy fake followers. Don't buy fake comments. Don't take part in fake scanny groups. I would much rather work with an influencer who's a nano influencer with only a thousand or two followers that get great engagement than someone with a bunch of fake followers and tons of shitty fake fire emojis. Kind of comes back to the whole integrity thing. Don't lie about your numbers. We'll figure it out. Hey, hot tip. Have a niche. Like have a common theme because if your theme is like, oh, I talk about my faith, I talk about dogs, I talk about protein shakes, I talk about working out, and I promote my OnlyFans, that's way too unfocused for any brand to likely align with you for a paid deal. Do you know your value? Can you show me your value? And if you don't know your value, that's okay. You'll understand it the more you do this. But come with ideas, right? Come with ideas. We want a partner to build brand and engagement and following and sales together. So if I reach out to you to hire you, then A, have an idea of what you want to charge or what you've been charging. Have an example of work you've done before. If you don't have an example of work you've done before, that's not a big deal. Show me what you could do, right? Because this is all about creativity. How can you move the needle? How can you help more people find out about my client's brand? So just Come with ideas, fruitful ideas, and know that if it works, we're gonna do more business together. And if it doesn't work, then we still might do more business together. But we're not gonna do more business together if you lie about your numbers, if you don't follow up with what you say you're going to do, if you don't over communicate about when you're going to post and how you're going to be posting and what this post looks like, and if you don't respond back in timely manner when I'm trying to communicate communicate about our campaign. Right, the key to a good influencer deal here, it's not a secret, it's that this is a partnership. So in order for it to work, I need to feel good about it, you need to feel good about it. And most importantly, never, ever, ever buy fake followers. Thanks for checking out my video. And like I said, I'm not an influencer, but I hire them. So if you are an influencer and you're looking for paid deals, hit me up, message me in the comments below, share this with a friend, let me know. I've got all kinds of brands who pay money, hundreds, sometimes thousands of dollars for influencer deals to the right influencer. So reach out if you want to or hit me up on social media at David A. Pride on everything. And we'll catch you in the next video.